Well, good evening, everybody. This is meteorologist Andrew Pinero. So Wednesday is probably, it looks like it's going to be my regular weather podcast day. I was setting up for the weather podcast and I realized, oh my, the studio is a mess. So I've been cleaning up for the past hour or two. And essentially, I prioritize getting this nice and clean over the weather podcast. So I'm sorry to say that, but staying clean and staying organized is very important when you're trying to run a business, especially a video production business. Even though this is weather forecasting and I have a weather consulting business, I am producing videos. So it's kind of a weather video production business is what I have. So staying organized, staying clean, that's very necessary. So let me show you what uh, everything looks like right now. You still have some loose wires. What I gotta try and do is maybe zip tie these together. The black one, that's an HDMI cable. The blue one's an ethernet cable. Those run over here. This little blue uh, black box, that's an HDMI splitter. So when I'm doing the green screen stuff, I have one side monitor over here to look at, and then on the other side of the green screen, I do have another monitor over there. It's actually this one. It's on a mobile base with wheels, so when I'm not using it, I use that as a monitor for watching, say, weather maps and radar. When I'm using it for the side monitor, I roll it up right in, in the spot there, so I have another side monitor. So that's why I have the HDMI cord splitting to one side monitor here, one side on the other side. And the ethernet cord, when I do go live, that is streaming the ethernet from the router that I have right over here to a little network switch that I have buried and tucked away in between my uh, server at the bottom there, my iMac for video editing. And then that goes up through the control box and into the cable, out through the cable mode into you guys. So that's the setup that I have. It's just a little bit of a mess right now. I have another router here. This is when I was trying to do weather podcasts outside or just storm talking outside. And then here's another mess. This is a lot of mostly audio gear in the middle here. Then we got the bag for the light. This is the charger for the light. This is a filter that goes on top of that light for my main studio camera. And then in the middle here, this tripod will ha has a mount that sits there that the phone I'm using right now is sitting there capturing me shooting the green screen. That's called the key light. That's what's lighting me up when I'm on the green screen. I got a fill light on this side, a fill light on this side, and I'm also working on two more fill lights, but they're not separate lights. They're going to fill the bottom gap here, which has no light. So that's what I'm working on there. And then the next mess is behind. So here's all the tripods facing the green screen. And down here, a lot of tangle of wires. I got some more audio gear there. When I'm recording music for my videos, I got my guitar, got my clarinet, got an amp. I got my Canon camera right over here. If you were curious, the one over there, that is a Sony A6300. That's a Sennheiser shotgun mic on it. The shotgun mic I can use on either of these, but that is an older camera, but still a really good camera. That is a T5i, bunch of GoPro stuff. So all of this is still messy. The other thing that's still kind of messy is the rug. When I'm on the green screen to avoid any kind of extra sounds, I usually don't have shoes on and it's on a carpet so it's nice and quiet. But yeah, there's still a lot of uh, dirt and debris tracking through here. So that's what I'm dealing with. So that, um, that's gonna take some time for the rest of the night. So I've just decided to record, show you guys what I'm doing, why I'm not going live today. And another thing I was working on, which finished and it is beautiful. So over here, 
this thermostat, it's a Wi-Fi thermostat, and when that reaches 73 degrees Fahrenheit, I have over here a Wi-Fi switch that turns on when that reaches 73 degrees, and that's connected to an air conditioner. And then after a certain amount of time, it drops to 68 degrees on the thermostat. This turns off. This studio is in an older house. I looked at some of the insulation from what the original part of this house. It's 1964 is when this house was built. So the studio is upgraded after that, but it still has some older stuff so there's no central air conditioning. So with this Wi-Fi system, I made my own central air conditioning. So got some neat things going on there. There's still a slight, slight little echo. You probably don't hear it on the clip mic that I'm using, but I hear it in my own ears. So I maybe add a little bit more sound insulation. It's pretty good. It's about a little over a year, year and four months now since I've started the build. I'll link in the description a, a video of my uh, original studio vi uh, build vlog. And with that, that pretty much wraps up this video. Oh, one more thing. What about the weather? Well, there's still a severe thunderstorm risk. If you get up northwest New York State, like near Lake Erie, Buffalo area, that is pretty much going to be just for the evening. After that, high pressure comes in. And it looks like that high pressure is going to be with us for a while. It's going to be nice Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, it looks like. Then Monday may bring in the next little weather maker. What will it be? Maybe some storms, maybe some severe weather tornado risks. Well, we'll talk about that in my uh, next video with the weather. It looks like tomorrow also I'll be uploading a car video on like little car maintenance. So I got some stuff planned for you guys. And that's pretty much it. This is meteorologist Andrew Panero. To see all of that content coming out, hit that little subscribe button below so you get notified whenever I go live or if I upload another video. Have a great evening, everybody, and I'll see you guys in the next one.